When you get out of prison or jail, you don't have to be hungry. Give us a call, you'll reach someone, or you can leave a message and we'll figure out a food pantry or a soup kitchen or something nearby to make sure that you have access to food. I'm Anya with Hunger Free Colorado, and we're a statewide nonprofit that connects people to food resources to meet existing need and then works on policy and systems and social change to end hunger long term. If you go to hungerfreecolorado.org and then navigate to the Find Food page, we have lots of good information on there about different food resource programs, nutrition programs, and we also have information about our statewide food resource hotline there. Um, so you can check out the food resource hotline if you want to call someone and have a conversation about programs and pantries and food banks and things like that are available in your area. And also to find out what programs you might qualify for, like SNAP. On that Find Food page, we also have a link to a food pantry map. And on that map, you can select what kind of resource you're looking for. Maybe it's a food pantry that gives out unprepared food that you would prepare yourself, or maybe you're looking for somewhere with hot meals, then you would select soup kitchen, and then you can put in an address or a zip code and uh, see what's in that area. We always recommend that you call places in advance to make sure that nothing has changed, um, but that includes a lot of helpful information. And then on that Find Food page, you can also check out what other general nutrition and food programs uh, might be available to you and how to get connected. And if you'd like to meet with someone in person and talk through food resource options or how to apply for SNAP or get some assistance with that, we also have folks who are out at different community sites in the Denver metro area. And our website has a calendar of where they'll be when, and you can also go get assistance there. My name's Russell with Food Bank of the Rockies. I'm a SNAP outreach representative here, and basically I help people apply for SNAP or food stamps. SNAP or food stamps is a program from the federal government that assists families or individuals with a certain amount of income to buy specifically food every month. If you apply and you qualify, they will send you an EBT card to your house in which they will put between $20 to $250 on it a month per person. I know that there is a big need for food assistance within the um, released inmate population. There's statistics that says 90% of people released from correctional facilities end up being food insecure during their time period of one month after being released. And so if you're interested in applying for this program, I think it can be of huge help. It alleviates the hurt and the costs of buying food, and it relieves that income for other important things. If you're interested in applying for SNAP, you can call us at 720-594-0030 or email us at fbrsnap at foodbankrockies.org. When you apply for SNAP, the amount of time that it'll take for them to determine whether you qualify or not can depend on a lot of different things. But on average, it will take anywhere between two weeks to a month for the Department of Human Services to give you a response as to whether you qualify or not. Now, usually when people are leaving correctional facilities or prisons, their income is below their expenses. And so if your income is below your expenses, you will qualify for an expedited application. And then with that process, the application will go a lot quicker and you are a lot more likely to be uh, approved for the application. You can call me and we can collect most of the information for your application before your release date. And then on the date of your release, we are able to just do your telephonic signature that day and then submit your application, which makes it a little bit quicker and less for you to do when you're released.